I'm a sustainer through and through, and always have been, and that's the truth. They say nothing moves without sustainment, and I believe that, 30th Brigade believes that. Getting the armor tank and getting the infantry to the fight is the transporter's bread and butter. Being able to sustain that and providing that is, is what we do as transporters. Yeah, not many people can do what we do. It's not just driving trucks. You have to get out, you have to tie down, you got to get the tracks on the back, you got to secure the load, and then you got to take it over the rail yard and you got to download it and make sure everything's good to go in a safe manner, right? This is a heavy, heavy load that they're moving. And uh, we're out here with civilian traffic on Fort Bragg, so they have to be very diligent, they have to be trained well, and we got to make sure they're doing everything in a safe manner. These vehicles are going to the railhead here at Fort Bragg. And then once they get loaded on the train, they're gonna go down to Georgia XCTC because the 30th ABCT is gonna be doing some training down there. So we're kind of supporting that Armor Brigade combat team by getting their tanks to the rail yard so that they can get their tanks down to Georgia. I think some of the challenges are that there's a lot of equipment we have to move over there and we have 15 heads we're working with and it seems like we could always use more soldiers out here. Not everybody can be everywhere all at once, so I think figuring out how to work as a team efficiently is definitely the biggest challenge, but over the past three days, we've already grown so much together and started to get into a groove. So a transporter really it sounds like the simplest of jobs, but a good solid transporter, you've got to be a team with your truck, and it's one of the best experiences I had on the deployment. The satisfaction with getting out in the truck with your A driver or your partner, y'all get into a routine operating and then that will continue and move forward and they'll become more effective with how they're doing operations. You know, we keep those teams together and, and roll through it. But the beauty of a transporter is they get to see the end product. So they get to see it from the start, the hard work, and at the end of the day, that product's either delivered uh, or where it needs to be. And, and that's uh, very rewarding to do and be able to support uh, infantry battalions or armored battalions and brigades moving forward. It's kind of a long chain of events, and this is the part that we play in it with our big pets. But at the same time, all the soldiers are being taken care of and staying safe. So those are the two goals. If we meet both, I know it's a good day. Thank <laughs> you.